this kind of energy on consecutive nights, all of the focus on the grand old game and everything that goes with it. It's awesome. Um, you know, we, we keep talking, especially these last two days, about how we kind of took for granted uh, the fans being, in the, you know, in the stadium and uh, just the atmosphere that they create. So, um, you know, last year was a real kick in the gut when it came to, uh, you know, just everything that we're so used to when it comes to baseball. And so to be able to have the fans back and to, to have this game happen again, um, it was incredible. It was awesome. They've done a really good job here. And, um, you know, it's, it's been a, it, it's definitely been a, a, you know, a time that I won't forget. I know Dave has been at it for a little while before it gets official. Like, how much did it mean for you to for him to make you a starter and what was the conversation? Like? I mean, a lot. You know, it was a, you know, he just kind of came up to me one day and uh, uh, he said, hey, how would you like to bat second in, in uh, DH in the All-Star game? And I kind of just smiled and gave him a big hug. And, uh, you know, it was, it was a really cool moment for me. It was, uh, it, it meant a lot and, um, you know, I'll cherish it forever. And so uh, to be able to do that, you know, it was kind of a, it, it, it's a dream that you have as a kid for sure. I know you've been with in the past as far as like on a team basis, but to see him go out and beat off and then come out and what was that sort of like? What was that like for you? Yeah, guys, guys, incredible. You know, just uh, the fact that he's actually able to play today after the uh, home run derby last night. Uh, how any of those guys are able to play today? It's a, uh, uh, you know, it's a, it, this is a tough place to play. It's uh, it's hard to breathe here. You get tired really quick, and uh, uh, you know, you, you can see it last night. They got gassed pretty quick, and so for them to be able to come back and play today, uh, especially if Tony to come back and pitch today, you know, it's it's pretty incredible that he's able to just just get through an inning. How did you feel about your pitches? About Otani's pitches? Yeah. Uh, he, he got me to roll over on ground ball. He did a good job. <laughs> what do you think about the uh, Coors Field fans booing all the Dodgers? You know where it is? It's fun. You know, it's a. Uh, it, it, it was fun. We were talking to the dugout. We weren't sure if uh, if anyone was going to get booed, and uh, uh, sure enough, you know, as soon as they called the first Dodgers, was a loud chorus of boos. So it was. Uh, um, yeah, it, it, it was fun. Uh, we enjoyed it. Um, you know. We get to come back here in a couple days to open the second half, so it'll be it'll be fun. And I guess on the other side, with no one batting right there, how cool was it? The reception he got both times. Was that was amazing. Um, you know, they did a really, they did a really good job. Uh, you know, no one was, you know, you really can't say enough about what he did when he was over here. And uh, you know, I know we're personally we're happy that he's no longer here because he, he's not fun to play against. He's very fun to watch, but he's not fun to play against because uh, you always feel like he's going to do something against you. So. Um, you know, it was really cool to see the fans give him the, the recognition that he deserved, and um, you know, it, it kind of makes you sit back and you know, almost wish that he could have uh, uh, won a little more here. But um, you know, it was, it was just fun to see the fans give him his recognition. Thank you. Thank you.